Yeah, okay, so here's how I'm looking at CCJ according, and I, I've made these marks uh, based upon your questions. Here's those uh, dates, June June 13th to July 26th, which kind of, you know, defined this value area, which we can see marked with this uh, orange rectangle. Anyway, uh, so this last run, I ran the fibs, and it's where these where this dip buying is occurring is just above this uh the golden pocket now this also happens to line up inside this value area of course that you've pointed out and if you look at this volume shelf here we're right there okay so things kind of line up in confluence and this is the area that i'm looking at you can see it marked with this red line at the 2258 spot okay so it's really it's going to be a golden pocket tap off this last run it's going to be a volume shelf. You know, I don't have the point of control on my settings, but I mean, you can look at it here. You can see that this is really where the majority of this volume shelf is, right? So we also know that we have a 2195 fundamental floor that we've been talking about. Let's just say for all intents and purposes, 22, okay? Which is the, the bottom of this value area. And we also have this technical floor of 20 bucks. Okay, so that's kind of what we're working on. So right now, what I'm looking at personally is how does this thing react right here at this 2258, this golden pocket right here off of this last run? That's kind of what we're, <clears throat> what I, what I intend to be looking at at the moment. I will probably be adding to my position around here, knowing that I have that. 22 fundamental floor which is also lining up with this 78 percent fib and then the 20 dollar technical floor which is really the be all end all for us right so that's kind of where we're looking right now we're below the 200 day moving average we got above it and it, re it didn't it didn't hold so let's see how it reacts here but in reference to that question i think that kind of uh sums it up uh, i hope it addresses it if it doesn't let me know the other thing that i've also noticed just because i play price action on this thing for quite some time you can see once this thing starts getting these lower wicks on the daily you know it's probably gonna it it, it bounces off of that once it starts building a base and gets the lower wicks it looks like it, it looks like it's setting up to do that, right? It kind of wants to build the base in here, which would make sense because it's still in the value area that we've pointed out and it's starting to get a little wicky. So those are good little signs. That's why I'm saying like this 2258 area for me is kind of the spot to see how it reacts there. And so far it's reacting well, right? We've had two days of dip buying after this big sell off. Uh, but we've got FOMC, <laughs> so who knows what's going to happen there. But uh, that's the deal. And we could watch XLE, too, because it does react with XLE. It is an energy name. All right. All right. Over and out.